party people and welcome back to the theater uh, I'm sleepy after having one day where I slept like seven hours and then one day where I slept eight and a half I was like sweet I am back on track I'm going to get sleep I'm going to be rested and then I woke up this morning I couldn't get to sleep last night and I woke up this morning and I got like four and a half hours of sleep so thought it was getting better but nope I'm super tired today so the plan today is to get everything I need to get done today done quickly. Uh, I think it should just be a short shift. I don't see why it shouldn't be. And then go home and sleep. <laughs> it's so sad that that is what my life is, is just get more sleep in when you can. But like I said in yesterday's vlog, exciting news, I got a ton of writing done last night. So I only have 3,500-ish words until I get to the end of the book, which is super exciting. So. That's a nice change, considering it's been like, and I only have four, four days left, I think? Something like that, yeah. So, excited about that. Should be able to get that done within an hour or two, once I sit down and focus. So, that's good, and then it'll be time to start that again. But that's fine. Anyway, I'm gonna go have a breakfast drink and get to work so then I can go home and I can sleep. I also need to do laundry today, because I'm running out of socks. It's just... We're just, I need to put my life together and I'm struggling. Alrighty, so I am home from work now. It is just about two o'clock. First thing I did when I got home was put on laundry because running out of socks and just clothes in general. I mean like the ones that I wear every day, you know, like you have the clothes you wear every day and then you have the clothes that you wear when you have to wear them. That's where it's at. So I did that, I made my bed, which has been a hot minute since that happened. And um, now I think I'm gonna try to get book to finish the edit. 3,500 words, that's reasonable. I should be able to do that in a couple hours. So fingers crossed it works out. And then I guess we'll start it over. I Last night I was like, oh, 3,500 words and I'm done. No, 3,500 words and I'm done this edit. And then I have to do it again and again and again. <laughs> I don't know how many times, honestly. I know that the next edit will still be pretty strenuous because there was a lot of stuff that I skipped because I was just getting so frustrated and bogged down because it's a longer book. It's about 30,000, 20 to 30,000 words longer than the first book and there were a lot of things that I had to add in. So I was getting really frustrated, so we'll see how the next edit goes, but hopefully the subsequent ones will be a lot better. Anyways, I'm gonna do that now, so I'll check in with you, hopefully with some positive progress. So know what I did instead of working on my novel? <laughs> I had a three hour nap. Yeah, uh, I mean, like I said this morning, I was really tired and I thought I was gonna be able to pull through and I was like, you know what, I'm pretty tired, let's just have a quick little tiny nap and I woke up at 5.30, which was like two hours in. I was like, I'm really comfy and now it's, it's seven, but I woke up at 6.30, but yeah, so I'm feeling great though, <laughs> hopefully. This still means I can get to sleep last night. I just, my sleep schedule is still so off and um, not fun. So I'm now sitting at my desk again and I'm going to try to get these 3,500 words done. It shouldn't take too long. Once I start it, it really shouldn't. Yay, I did it. It was a struggle of a month, that's for sure. I have one, two, like nine days out of 28 where I didn't even touch my story, but I did it. It is done. It is edited. Round two, complete. Round three is still gonna be a struggle, like I was saying earlier, because there was a lot of stuff that I skipped on this one because I was getting super annoyed and super frustrated. But we're at the end, 123, almost 124,000 words. Bam. <laughs> That's almost 30,000 words longer than book one. I think it's about 25,000 words. I don't know, something like that. So yeah success feeling pretty I don't know it's this weird thing when I finish something like this I don't feel like s super happy or excited like yeah it's a great relief but it's also just like okay I've done that now what it's like emptiness anyway done that now what <laughs> now what is definitely doing it again I'm going back to page one of 170 and starting over but should take a look at my notes before I do that and um, 
see everything that I need to fix. Maybe watch a YouTube video in between, but yeah, feeling pretty good that I accomplished this, so win, but also still gonna do it again. <laughs> okay, so I just uh, blogged about finishing my book, so that'll be up when this is going up or a little bit after, I guess, because I always time it for 10.35 and I don't know why. Um, so that was nice. And I just looked at all my notes from the last pass through the last edit and I don't think it's as bad as I've been making it up to be in my head. Then again, my notes might not be the best, so maybe it's worse, but I'm feeling all right and I think like maybe we can look at chapter one and see where that's going at least. I don't know. It's only nine o'clock, so I've got a little bit more time before I'm going to be slowing down and getting ready for bed although with my three hour nap who knows but I'm um feeling pretty positive about this which is nice because it's been a month of struggle to put it there's no other way to put it it's just been a month of struggle so yeah excited to get into this don't hate my book anymore at this moment we'll see usually happens again but yeah so I'm gonna look at chapter one see how it goes. I have quite a few notes for chapter one, but some of them I think I fixed as I was going, so we'll see. Okay, so I got chapter one done. Uh, there was a fair amount to fix, but it went smoothly, so I'm hoping that that's an indication of how this entire edit is going to go, uh, but I'm feeling pretty good about things. I had to add a couple paragraphs in, but it wasn't a very dreadful thing. It still took me a while because I was getting distracted by everything, but I'm feeling all right and that chapter was about 5,000 words so I'm just under 9,000 for the day so I would say this has been a success even in spite of my nap and working earlier but I think the nap was necessary because my body was really hurting when um, I woke up just because I think you know I've been at work a lot more recently and running around the theater and stuff so yeah it was it was nice it was necessary I'm a little bit tired now but um, it's just 20 after 10 so I'm trying to decide if I want to do another chapter or I don't know. So I'm, I'm thinking about things at the moment. We'll see where we get to with the train of thought, I guess. Okay, so it's been like a solid 20 minutes of puttering, not really doing much. I decided not to add another chapter. I didn't even look at it. I put down the camera. I was like, nah. Um, but yeah, so it's about 20 to 11 now, so I think it's time to slowly wind myself down for bed and hopefully I can get to sleep tonight. I just still feel like I'm in a sleep deficit from last week, and so anytime I don't get a full night's sleep now, I panic because last week was rough. I felt so nauseated and so sick and just, it was, it was bad. So fingers crossed I can get to sleep tonight and we'll start to get my sleep schedule back on track. Otherwise, there's gonna be a lot of napping, I feel. But yeah, so my battery's about to die, so I'm going to end the vlog here. So thanks so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.